Hello everybody, my name is ZombieLab115 and today we are going to be starting a zombie storyline within Black Ops 2. Okay guys, time to give you a little bit of backstory. The person you're about to see who gets up in a minute is Joe. I will be voicing Joe throughout this uh, survival series and um, he's been through a lot. He's died recently and a scientist came by and uh, saw his dead corpse and realized it was just he was had enough time on him on his uh, de decomposing corpse that he was able to be revived. Joe doesn't know yet that uh, the scientist is the one who revived him. Well, he's, his goal is to make it to a bus to see if he can go to a nearest science uh, operation center to see if he can meet the scientist who revived him. Now, you'll see them. this is the map. He wants to go to there, the transit station, to see if there's any buses left to get to the scientist. He will have to make it through the town. He starts at the farm, because that's where he starts. And then um, he will go to the town, and then you wonder about the transit thing. Uh, first, he's gonna go to the di he's gonna go to the diner before he reaches the transit. So we'll get this started, guys. All right, this house has been through enough. I can't stay here any longer. Look around for my pistol. It's right, left on the couch. Take this and uh, see. There's a lot of them in the barn around there. And then there, for they've been there for a while. Let's go downstairs. Let's open the front door and see if we can sneak past them. I don't want to alert them. If I have, to, if I. You know, I just don't want to. Yeah, they didn't see me. Good thing they didn't. Alright. See, so I need to get this door open. I'll try to knock it down. Alright, I got the door down. There's a fence part down. I got at least one of them, one of them off. It's enough space to get me through. Let's see, because I, I want to... See, I, I want to leave, but also don't, because I know... Uh, my father left a shotgun in the tractor back there, but I guess we're gonna go. I'm debating on if I want to go back there and try to sneak past them. Now nah, there, there's too many. There's you saw. There's so many there. I don't want to check these uh, check these cars and see if they have everything in them. Hopefully they do, because I can't use this pistol forever. It's gonna run out of ammo. I got quite a few clips though with me, so hopefully it'll it'll last me. But I do want to find another weapon. I do know there's uh, SWAT vans who leave MP5s around. Well, this like, looks like one of them. Let's see if there's one here. First. It's really dusty out here. Check this car. Doesn't look like a SWAT van. It's not going to have anything in it. Useful. Most of these are all destroyed and looted anyways. Hopefully someone drops something on the way out of these vehicles. Let's see. Oh, shit. Yeah. Look. SWAT van right here. Let's pick that baby up. It's got some clips in it, some mags actually. Um, yeah, and no one left any snipers in trees. Uh, and pretty, uh, sometimes, if I had to happen once, when I walk around, I saw a person who climbed up the tree, hiding from some zombies, and I cleared out the zombies, looked up, and he, he was a skeleton. He definitely started, died of starvation. Oh, I hear something. Yeah, a zombie. They'll knife him. Gotta be quiet though. Look, I get a dead corpse. It must be the one he was eating on. He stabbed him twice to make sure he's dead. Right in his head. I hear a dog somewhere. See, oh, it's not, what's, is it, oh, never mind. That's death. I thought that would say something. The town's name. Can't see those windows. Too foggy. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, um. There's quite a bit down there in town square right in the middle. Let's see. Yeah, that's a horde for sure. So I don't know exactly what I want to do because I don't want to spook them and I don't want to have, have a fuck ton on me. I really don't want that many zombies to be on me. Let's see. Let's look around. See, because like, I want to loot this town because there's obviously got to be something in here I can use. But that looks like a uh, gun shop over there. Let me armor right here. Let me jump down and. Take a look over here first. Oh, one has my attention. Uh, I don't know if I want to kill that yet. Here, let me get. I have to get. I'm gonna get in here and and build some barricades. Okay. After scouting around, I managed to take some doors off and some dollies and uh, 
Oh yes, and and build barricades. But yeah, this this was an armory yeah, or a small hunting store at least. So an M16, which is pretty strange, but or maybe it's possibly a stash left. But oh, I hear I hear some zombies. Um, possibly a stash from another survivor. This is like an old-fashioned um, old-fashioned shotgun here. Let's see how good it is. Oh yeah, yep, I'm getting some. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take these guys out. I don't want too many here on the barricade, otherwise it won't last. Oh yeah, there's a lot here. Oh yeah. Shoot. I only have two mags left from this, uh, shit. So. I got one last mag from this, and then, uh, Switch a different gun. I'm um, Olympia. Reload this. God, there's so many here. Let's see, five words. Oh yeah, let's pick up the 1911 so we can do a little bit more damage before. I'm getting really tired. I just don't. I want to. I just don't want to pass out knowing how many are here. There's still a lot out there, but I'm hoping my barricades are standing. So. I'm hoping they're gonna last long because I have to get to sleep here. I'm gonna have to sleep on the floor. It sucks, but I have to do it. Well, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Hopefully, I can loot the town tomorrow. Good night. Good luck.